So, long story short, I am in Jen's town. You will notice. You will notice the uh, the border. I'm sure at this video. Uh, it's day 22, and that we've been looking for a snail. Um, the conditions are: it has to be raining. Uh, it's kind of rare at night, so there was a lot of saving, and searching, and all that. But uh, it's easier during the day. You're going to be looking from April till September. They get really common during the morning in June, and from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. in June. But then they start getting rare again. Um, then in July, I think they're common at night. So I will put that information in the description for this video. But basically, raining, and then you're going to need... I've only really seen them on this bush. Um, basically, don't... Don't mess it up this time. Yeah, yeah, I caught a snail. Okay, well, maybe I found a snail. The only thing I can recommend is the fact that they actually will sometimes hide under the leaves. So do look closely. You might just see a little piece of the head or the um, cell itself sticking out. All right, and so, then... The, yeah, it's cool as, like that. As Jen just said to me, I don't know if you guys can hear it, um, they will sometimes hide under the leaves. So you'll have to look around trying to like, just look for the head and be a little bit careful when you're swinging your net. Um, I hit the tree and the snail jumped off the off the bush, so we had to restart. A little bit chaotic. Killed the so. snail. So I'd like to thank Jen and her boyfriend for being very patient. And I will hopefully be doing a video soon coming to Jen's town after I get things figured out. So, alright. Thanks, guys. Yay! And bye.